Alright, so what up, what up, what up everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is the epic, the past terrific vlogger Bonejit signing into this new vlog video. Wag malungkot, Masa Peps. Vlog video guys, I am going to show you that one of the videos actually cap captured um, our attentions nowadays because as we all know, di ba, naranasan natin nangangate sa mga mukha natin. And then, we don't know which part at bakit, ako ano, ano ang dahilan nito. Well, paano, panoorin nyo po yung video na ito. And do not forget to click the subscribe button below, including the notification bell, so you won't miss any videos coming from me. And of course, I want to share also my knowledge to everybody. You know, knowledge can be gained everywhere, right? So, ayan na po. So, ayun. Give, uh, leave a comment down below then kung may advice ka or may suggestions ka or kung ano ang reaction mo sa makikita mo na video na ito. Let's do this! Nangangati ba ang mukha mo? Parang may gumagapang na hindi mo nakikita. Alamin natin kung bakit Gumagamit ng kaunting blue ang mga researchers para i-examine ang ating mukha. Kaunting blue lamang. At kung gumagamit kayo ng peel of mask, for sure familiar kayo sa mangyayari. And of course, there will be small white heads, black heads, hair follicles na matatanggal dahil sa glue na ito. At akala nito, meron pa palang buhay na microorganisms na nagkatara dito. Tingnan natin ang maigi at pakinggan ang mga boses na ito. Entomologist Michelle Troutwine at the California Academy of Sciences in San Francisco studies these long-term tenants of ours. They've got eight little legs because they're actually arachnids related to ticks and spiders. Yep, you almost certainly have dozens of these stowaways on you right now and don't even know it. Usually, your immune system keeps them in check. But in rare cases, a population boom causes a red rash. But don't freak out, seriously. They're actually not such bad house guests. You're not born with them. Face mites are passed down from parent to baby. They spend their days tucked right inside our hair follicles, next to the hair. All cozy. See that yellow stuff? It's sebum that greasy oil your skin makes to protect itself from drying out. That's what face mites eat. When you're asleep, they climb out to the surface and mate before crawling back into your pores to lay their eggs. So that's fun. But if you're thinking about scrubbing them all off, forget it. You'll never get rid of all of them. And here's the weirdest part of all. Face mites don't have an anus. They just eat and eat, but never poop. They've made our vast landscape of skin into their own personal kingdom. Just think of them as a natural, maybe even healthy part of your skin ecosystem. Now that you know that, you never have to be lonely again. Ayun, di ba guys? Nakikita po natin na ang dami-dami pala nating face mites. So that's why we need to face, um, uh, to wash our face, to do some scrubbing. Um, you know, we need to take good care of our skin because ang dami din pala tayo, ang dami din palang nakatira sa mga pores natin, di ba? Na sanhi, na pangangating, na hindi natin alam kung saan banda or yung parang gusto mo nang kamutin yung mukha mo bigla. Diba? Especially at night, during at night, 
pag galing ka sa labas, dapat mag, uh, mag, magwawash tayo ng mukha para linisin lang. Ganon, ba diba? So, well, anyway, guys, kung may reaction po kayo sa video na ito, please do not forget or do not hesitate to leave it down to the comment box below. And including your suggestions and comments or advices, it will be very much appreciated by yours truly. And kung gusto nyo po maging ma-shoutout sa next video vlog ko, um, pa-comment na lang din po down below. And do not forget to click the subscribe button below, including the notification bell para hindi mo rin ma-miss ang lahat ng mga bagong videos ko na i-upload dito sa YouTube channel. And share and like the video and do lahat tayo dapat masaya lang. Ganon! Goodbye!